Just finished a meeting here at Bowden Silver. This is the potential silver mine just outside Louis. So I've had a good talk to the proponents of the silver mine and basically asked as many questions as possible, gathered a lot of information and made some contacts there so that I can come back and ask further questions as time goes on if I need to. I'm standing here today at the Louis railway station. Now unfortunately this particular railway station and railway line here haven't been used since 1988. And it is a great shame around New, regional New South Wales as you drive around and talk to people, the great piece of infrastructure that have been paid for in previous years by taxpayers of the state are no longer being used. On this railway line, I talked to some people today who used to catch this particular railway line through to Sydney when they were at school or university. I was here today to talk to the Louis Action Group. And the Louis Action Group has been formed, has been in existence for some time, to discuss the potential of the silver mine, Bowden Silver Mine, and the ramifications for the Lua community. But it was good to hear the concerns from the residents here and, and just to see the ramifications and implications for the silver mine here on the residents and in particular on Louis. So it's a fair way to go for there. I, I, I gave them some of my advice or some ideas that I had in terms of what they may do going ahead with Bowdens in particular, with the CCC, the Community Consultative Committee, and in fact with the earliest process. I'm promising, or I've promised to follow up a couple of things for them and I'll come back to them and I'll continue those discussions with them. But it is great to get around and talk to people in various communities about the issues and concerns they have. And I'm at the extreme eastern edge of the electorate here in Louis. And what's important to people in Louis is definitely different to what's important to people in Tringy, so at the other end and, and everywhere in between. So it is great to travel the entire electorate and go around the electorate and make sure I am across the issues that affect people across the entire electorate. Another day and the campaign trail has come to an end and I'm standing here in Buckaroo at the moment, just outside Mudgee. I started off the day in Mudgee and then went across to Louis, met with Bowd and Silver, and then met with the Louis Action Group. And I've got some information to follow up from that particular meeting or those meetings today. I've ended up back here at Buckaroo and had some good discussions with people here. Across the electorate, even though the electorate isn't huge, there are certainly some differences. At one extreme, where I was today in Louis, that's, that's the easternmost extreme of the electorate. Just the landscape is different, the rolling hills are different. Just what people are doing in this area or these areas is quite different when I go to the other extreme in the western direction, it's out past Trengi, and the people in Trengi, their needs are really quite different to people around Louis and, and around this area. It's part of my whole philosophy of getting around the entire region, making sure I do get to the entire region. And my idea of that is really to make sure I am across the various issues and, and things of importance to people in this electorate, and I'll continue to do that. This has been Matthew Dickerson, your independent voice. Music